Hi everybody Hello. and uh, welcome to today's vlog. As you can see the Rice and Tatties are back together again after my wee trip to Wales and um, we're celebrating our anniversary weekend this weekend which has been five years together which has been nice and so we that. decided last night we went out for a lovely dinner at um, Fasanda in Edinburgh um, where we were so well looked after, so big huge thanks to the guys at Facenda in Edinburgh. We'll link Facenda down the bottom so that yeah. you can book your tables there because honestly it's service, highly recommended. Yeah. Service is impeccable, the food yeah. is impeccable as well, so definitely uh, it's a good night out kind good of night thing. Out. Yeah. So today we're going to venture out to Gladstone land in the Royal Mile Edinburgh. I'm just going to read what it says here about it. It's just reopened after having a 1.5 million refurbishment and it's a 17th century townhouse in Edinburgh. I'd never heard of it before but um, Fourth One has been really promoting it recently mm. hasn't it because they've had a competition with the National Trust of Scotland to win a year's National Trust and entry to Gladstone Land and some money to spend. So Fourth it. One is a local radio here for those who are in Based mostly Edinburgh and Fife, isn't it? I think it's kind of mostly. Yeah. So um, it's a historic townhouse, and what they have done, they have divided it into three sections so that you can see what it was like uh, for the 19th and the 20th century. So 17th, no, 18th, 19th, and 20th century. And they've also got this massive um, ice cream parlor there, which I'm looking forward to going to try. So we're going to take you guys along with us. Did you know about the ice Wait. cream parlor? Is that why we haven't eaten yet? No, 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 no. I've had a packet of crisps. Yeah, I'm good. sure. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, we, ha we haven't eaten yet because I'm still Liar. full from last Liar. night. Um, so, yeah, we'll take you along with us <laughs> and hopefully um, you'll enjoy the trip and get to see. We're noticing that people are really enjoying these kind of videos we're making of places around and about Edinburgh. And I was thinking today, actually, why don't we do a walkthrough video with you one day of Edinburgh? Because we haven't done that yeah, that's true. Um, where we'll take you from Holyrood Palace up to Edinburgh Castle, the gardens and maybe some of our beautiful cathedrals we have here as well. Um, so if you're interested in that, leave some notes down below and we'll get that sorted of over the next few weeks actually, probably. Yeah. So, we hope you enjoy our trip with us today and we'll see you in a bit. Bye. <laughs> So you see this pub here, this used to be the end of Edinburgh, where Edinburgh actually used to end in the old days. And that was called the World's End. I don't have my glasses, so I'm not frowning or anything like that. But, um, so uh, we're in front of the Gladstone land. land house. Land, just land. Oh, Gladstone land. Yeah, um, here in Royal uh, at the Royal Mile. So it's just uh, at the beginning where you're go gonna go up to the uh, to the castle. So and we missed that one. We were going up and down. Yeah, trying to find it. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. we're gonna head in. We'll take you with us. Yeah. Hello, 
Hello. 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 Yes. So who is Mary Wilson? Why is called like this this room? Mary Wilson was this single lady who purchased this space that you see here. Did she go by that? Exactly. And transformed this in a boarding house for guests. Say 1766, and uh, this is a draper shop of Elizabeth Pillins and William Dawson. Okay. And they got married in 1761, they were merchants. John Riddick and Margaret Noble. They were married, of course, but oh. women kept their surname at the time. Oh, okay. And they had five children, two servants, sharing a, for that time, quite spacious floor. But of course, for us, it's a little bit tight for such a large family. <laughs>
an ice cream? Lovely. I like this little My Earl Grey and um, candy pecan loaf thing. Cinnamon roll this looks and good for Mr. I thought you wanted ice cream. I know, but it just looks so good. Okay. An ice cream and tea doesn't work. They've got interactive smellies. I think this, oh, it's cloves. Yeah, it's cloves. So each table <laughs> have, has a different one. How about yeah, that one? I can't get that one out. So I don't want to pull it too hard because it breaks it. So each table, I think, tells you how much the price of herbs, spices, sugars, rice, all that kind of stuff were in those days. This is a nice place to, to have coffee very, yeah, we've, and tea. Yeah, it's been a really great experience. As mm. always with National Trust, as we find dinner. Look at this. Oh my god. Look at the amount of cinnamon in there. I wish it was hot, but it would be nice if it was hot. Mmm. Mmm. Huh. Do you know what that reminds me of? Cinnabon. Cinnabon. Mm. <laughs> mm. It's loaded. So good. Cheers. So, check out my cake. Thank you so much. Thank you. Guys. Thank you. Thank you guys. Yeah. <laughs> so that's us. Done. Done. Oh my gosh, like it's really good. It's really really nice. I mean that the cafe, the cafe at the end too. it was like that uh, cherry on the top yeah, uh, yeah. after the tour. The cinnamon uh, bun is well worth it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Even if you don't go to to do the tour at Gladstone Land, the, um, the cafe. The cafe. Oh my gosh. Nice uh, ambience. And um, yeah, just all the kind of music I like as well. That was good. Yeah. So, highly recommend Gladstone Land for you to try. Uh, well done, National Trust of Scotland again. Yeah. Um, I would highly recommend you join National Trust of Scotland. It's very cheap every month, and you can get to all these places for free. We pay what seven pounds something a month, and we can get to anywhere, including Edinburgh Castle. Mm. Or is that the the other one? Anyway, I have no idea. Yeah, one it's of the well two. Worth it. But well, um, so. Yeah, Gladstone Land is just between St. Giles and I forgot what that castle. Uh, the castle, yeah, but uh, more of the um, that church over there. I forgot what it is, <laughs> but I think it's called the hub. Yeah, ah, it's the hub for the festival. Yeah, so in between that, just after uh, Brodies. So is it Brodies? Deacon? Deacon, Deacon Brodies. Brodies? Yeah. So just further up, and then over here. Cool. So glad, uh, oh, glad, hope <laughs> you guys enjoy uh, the, this vlog, and we'll see you soon. <laughs> the sun's right in my eyes. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Bye.